Hi everyone, we are back with more from Alan Wake 2 and I wanted to thank you so much for all the support I get from you. Just keep it up with that and with hitting the subscribe button, it is greatly appreciated. And like I mentioned in the last video, we will now grab every single collectible in this location and in Cauldron Lake and Watery as well. But first, let's speak with Tor a little bit more. You and I need to talk, Tor. We need to talk. <sighs> Damn right. Lots for me to explain. But not here. The knight's got ears. We can have our talk in your head. You have a room there, right? How do you know about that? I'm your grandfather. <laughs> what don't I know? Yes, he knows everything. Okay, let's do that then. Mr. Tor, tell me something I don't know. The mind place. You know about my mind place? How is that possible? We all have the power. Find the truth. Damn right I do. Odin already told you you're a seer. You can gaze into their heads, see the truth. See past the lies. Past this bullshit horror story. Us Andersons are bound by it. You can fight it. Don't be the story. Make the story. It's true. I am a seer. I have a power. My mind place is more than I thought it was. This isn't my intuition. I'm seeing their thoughts. Is this why I know the truth about Logan? While well, everyone else forgot? Yes, you have powers. Just like I thought, right? She is the, in this para utilarian, so... That is so cool, damn it. Just like Jesse Faden. And I believe also that... Uh, Mr. Dor... That Mr. Dor is her father. If that's true, god damn it. This is really this is really insane. Yeah, my grandfather. You said you were my grandfather. If that's true, why wasn't I told about you? You were part of our fucked up family way before this horror story. I was a shitty fucking dad to Freya. Your mom didn't deserve that. Not one bit. Things were said and done. Not a day goes by, I haven't regretted it. But that fucking father of yours didn't make things any easier. I know Freya is gone. So I need to apologize to you. I am sorry, Saga. I can see he's sorry. Mom said she didn't want anything to do with my grandfather. And that my father died before I could remember. It all matches. Tor and Odin are part of my family. Well, that's fantastic. So, Odin, Tor, Saga, Freya. Shit, who else? Fantastic. All the gods of Asgard. Let's uh, see with mom. You said you were a shitty father to my mom. Is that why she left? Freya never looked back. My girl was strong. Freya always thought our powers had a dangerous side. Odin and me did fuck with things that should not have been fucked with. Your mom had common sense. She raised you right. Kept you safe. I'm not surprised she didn't tell you about the Anderson power. She was always protecting me. Whenever I told my mom about my mind place, she called it make-believe. I wish she'd been more honest with me. At least towards the end. And she was not even at the end. Oh boy. My father. Mom wouldn't talk about my father. 
Some doors are better left closed. Your dad was a complicated bastard. Always thinking too many steps ahead. That's not how we work. There was trouble, and then he was gone. I didn't handle it well. Freya didn't want anything to do with me after that. I can't blame her. I never knew my dad or my mom's family. So many broken relationships in my past. I won't lose mine. With Logan. With David. I won't stop until they're safe. Uh, he said that some doors should have been closed. Yeah, Mr. Door. I guess. Oh boy, the clicker. I have the clicker. Can I use it to save my daughter? An app. Get your guitar roaring and your drums crashing. Blow reality's eardrums. Just the light switch isn't enough. It's Tom's story we're dealing with. So he's got to be the one to rewrite it. After that's done, he can flick that switch to bring the whole thing home, baby. I can't use the clicker without Wake. Tom. Meaning Wake. He needs to rewrite the story first. I can't stop the horror story without him. No, you cannot. Alright, we have so many new clues oh and that case is clo what the what the hell was that where is my case <laughs> oh jesus christ figured all this out already so this goes here and that goes there yes and that's just uh fantastic the overlap tour is here in the overlap gotta find him and get the fuck out Whoa, I guess, Saga, that you already did that. Damn, the case is closed. Wake wrote Logan into the story. He had no right to use her like this. There is still time to make him fix it. I won't give him a choice. Okay. Whatever you say. Okay, Tor and my father had problems. <clears throat> Oh shit, then what? Why did mom left? Okay, that's why. Because Tor had problems with uh, your dad, okay. Uh. And get remorse. Uh, okay, not there, then we're here? Logan's? No. My life in watery? Hmm. Oh hell no. What the hell is going on? Then where? Oh shit, seriously? The way Tor behaved? I'm surprised my mom hung around for as long as she did. But he is genuinely sorry. And what with that? Oh boy. Cannot use those, okay, and in the story is the same, right? Oh no, we can use something nice, the clicker. The clicker is right here. Because Rake wrote the story, only Wake can edit it. It's how to stop the story. Exactly. Wake needs to be the one to rewrite the ending. And I'll need to keep an eye on him. Area around the overlap, dark place. What? What the hell? Why not? Oh boy. The overlap? Oh. Overlaps require pieces of art to enter. Is that because of the dark places focus on art? Maybe. And wait, was that over there? Whoa. 
yeah, more clues, but... Okay. But for later. So I guess that's everything for now. Right? Yeah, probably. Okay, so let's go with... Oh, thank you, Tor, for everything. Thanks for telling me this, Tor. I need to go find Wake. To stop this. The old gods of Asgard will be ready to help. Me and my bro will bring the rock when you need it. Remember, your daughter is alive. Just kept from you by this bullshit horror story. I needed to hear that. Thanks, Grandpa. Yeah, thank you. Don't you are don't worry about me, kiddo. The best. I'll drag my sorry ass over to Odin. A few shots of the Anderson's finest will fix us both up. See you soon, Saga. Yep. The FBC See you too. is holding Wake at the sheriff station. I need to make Agent Estevez understand. They have Wake and I have the clicker. We have to work together to stop this. Casey. Okay. Do you read me, Casey? Damn it. Where are you, Casey? He better be okay. Focus, Saga. Get to the station. To wake. Yeah, where is Casey? God damn it. Oh, manuscript page. Damn it. No, no, no. Why are you hiding that one? Come on, let's check it out. What is this about? Cynthia's lamp. Right now? Oh. When Cynthia Weaver was downstairs at breakfast, Rose snuck into her room. With all the lamps in the room, it took her a while to find the one with an angel. Luckily, the dream Alan had sent her had been very clear. Rose was certain that Cynthia would not miss one lamp. She had so many. Tonight, Rose would put the lamp in a shoebox and let it sink into the garden pond. That's what Alan wanted. That's how she could help him. The thought made her whole body buzz with joy. Cynthia knew the lamp was missing the very moment she came back to her room. She was overcome by grief. It had been Tom's lamp, one of the few things that reminded her of him. It had not worked in a long time with the cord severed and the light switch gone. But there are other kinds of lights than the ones we can see. The invisible light of the angel lamp had held Cynthia together all these years. With tears welling in her eyes, she didn't see the shadows shifting in the corners of her room. All right, poor Cynthia. Here we have another gate, yeah. We can just unlock those. Uh, I don't think that we will have to come back here. I don't think so. But yeah, we can just unlock this, then why not? There is probably nothing here, right? We, we just checked those places before. All right, and uh, what is there? Yeah, I guess over here. Oh, yes, and we will follow this path. This path over here. And we will collect everything we can. Because if I'm correct, then... Jesus, why this case, but we... Oh! Rightful station. Okay, new case. Get the clicker to wake and make him fix his attempt to play God. That's the plan. But the FBC have him. No, and we have nothing about that. Damn it. Oh, but fact and fiction. Oh, yeah, and those two that we cannot use, just like in the story. Right? Still nothing. Oh, now we have three. Damn it. Uh, yes, and uh, what I wanted to check is the map. Yes, we need to go through here. We already see some stash. Three stashes, but there is much more. Launch boxes, puzzles, things like that. So, well, let's go. Why is it so... Maybe not yet dark, but... What was that? Oh, okay, we can go through here.
What do we have here? Another page. Oh boy. This time Rose at Bingo Night. Oh boy. Bingo. Every night was Bingo Night at the Valhalla Nursing Home. Each time Rose drew a ball from the cage and called out its number, some of the residents shouted Bingo, no matter what was on their cards. Some of them sat mute, their cards full, never calling out. Some of them would try to steal the ball from her. Some of them would chastise the others for acting out. It was like herding a cloud of cats. Rose didn't mind. She liked cats. She knew she was where she was supposed to be, with her little Vikings waiting for the hero to come. Tonight, the residents were restless, more so than usual. Ati was wearing Blum's coveralls again. Tor stood by the phone. Too late. Rose saw the hammer in his hand. The garden lights started to flicker, the darkness and rain pressing against the windows. The time drew nigh. But that is all in the past right now. So we can forget about this and we can focus on... Oh, I'm grabbing a lunchbox, which is right over here somewhere. Where are you? Show yourself. And oh, right here. Another lunchbox. Right, nice. Whoa, nine. Don't pretend to be anyone or anything besides who you are. Yep. Always. Alright. Where should we go now? Let's see, where are we? Oh yes, we are going good. We are going very good. Oh my god. Whoa, Jesus Christ. Can we go there? Oh, please, please, can we go? No, it's blocked. We cannot jump. We are not a suicider, so we will not jump from such a high cliff, but... Whoa. What the hell is this? Oh my god. That's a key. Key to what? Okay, probably to a stash. But where is the stash? Somewhere close. Whoa! <laughs> cult box. Don't tell me it's to this one. That would be too good. Yes! <laughs> well, that is perfect. Yeah, uh, what? Wait, why I cannot... Oh shit, this is different. Oh, this is the better one, right? This exploding one that I have one only in my... Oh my god, in my stash. Oh uh, yeah, let's uh, discard that one. Come on. Yeah. I am taking this exploding flare. Ah, uh, you can't hide from the trees. You are... We are everywhere. Oh shit, they are here? Then that's not good, then we should run away from here. Let's go, let's go... ...from that crazy place. Can I jump from this cliff here? Come on! Oh, come on! Are you serious that we cannot do this? Oh yes, at least we can go like that here, nice. What is this house there? I don't know, maybe some... Some safe house, actually, yeah. We need some safe place here. In that forest. But I am not seeing any enemies, so... This is a little bit strange, but... Nice as well, right? Oh shit. Did I just said something? Bloody freaking hell, come on. Why it's always happening? To me. That I am thinking about something and this thing is just popping. 
Uh, we have some generator. Yes, we do. Come on, do the magic, Saga. Do the magic. Ah, oh, shit. Too late. Come on. Oh, yes. Shotgun ammo, always. Manuscript. What is it this time? Bright Falls. Oh, let's go. The 81st annual Deer was just around the corner. Everyone in Bright Falls was bustling. There were banners to be hung, pies baked, deer masks sold. Bright Falls had made the top 100 American small town lists for its modest rustic charm. The town expected a lot of tourists this year, but a shadow hung over the Deerfest preparations. The forecast promised rain. Fearful whispers promised more murders. The police were on high alert. Sheriff Breaker had deputies patrolling the streets at night. Bright Falls was no stranger to odd happenings, but to cancel Deerfest? Out of the question. The town's folk were anxious, their anticipation mixed with fear. People had restless dreams. The lights seemed dimmer. Flood water pressed in on the town. And the shadows poured in with it. All right. Um, let's quick save. And let's see with this box if we can stash that here. Like, oh shit, come on. Oh, we can have only one. Jesus Christ. Um, I don't know. I think I will leave that one here. Yeah, let's uh, swap it with flares for now. Whoa, is there a wolf? Where is he? God damn it. Oh, he's here. Don't. Yeah, right. Oh, come on. What? I just dodged that. Oh, you mother freaker. Come on. In your face. All right. Give me back my... Oh, shit. Give me back my arrow. Yeah, yeah. I can reload. And then we can take it. Better. Okay. One enemy down. How many more to go? Oh, shit. Wait. What is out there? Another wolf? I don't know, that looks strange. Maybe not, maybe something else. I don't know, that is so crazy. What is over here? Whoa, nothing. Okay. <laughs> oh boy, okay. We are having some... Some stash over here for sure. Oh, right, something like that. Well, where should we start? Where is... The oh! Okay, wait, here's the stash. So, follow the arrows, I guess. Yep, okay. Here is the first arrow. We are 
looking here. So this is the first symbol. All right. Then go to the left. And then we are having this symbol. All right. Uh, that symbol, this symbol. Then where are we looking? Over there. Bloody hell. Too high. <laughs> this is too high for us. What the... Oh. Wait, what's going on over here? Oh. Okay, here. So then over there. And we have this one. Okay. And like this. Okay. Jesus Christ. I hope I will remember that. Uh, so let's go. Yeah, those on sides. Then... Yeah, that one and... And this one. Yes. Awesome. Come on. Oh, shit. Of course. I mean, I can pick nothing. Over here. Bloody box. hell. There's another cult stash. Another locked box? What the hell? What is she talking about? Is she crazy or something? I don't know. Um. Yeah, let's discard that one. And I will pick... This explosive one, right? Yeah, it can be really, really handy. We can use that one for some freaking enemies. And we should just continue through here, I guess. Oh, another manuscript page. Nice. Why not? Koskela's break into the FBC lab. When the government seized the land around Cauldron Lake and set up their laboratory there, Ilmo Koskela knew they knew something. Together with his brother, they felt obliged to take a look inside. The Federal Bureau of Control Security was a joke. The Koskelas walked in delivering coffee. Back in Watery, they pored over the stack of files they grabbed. The FBC was researching something in the lake, something they called the Shadow. Everyone who went into the lake came back a monster. Hartman had gone into the lake. He'd come back bad. The FBC had captured him, interrogated him. Based on his ravings, Barbara Jagger had gone into the lake as far back as the 60s. She'd come back bad. The writer, Alan Wake, had gone into the lake. He'd faced Jagger, pushed some mystic light switch into a hole in her chest, flicked the switch and gotten rid of her. If Wake ever came back, he was bound to be bad as well. Yes, he did that in the first part. Oh boy. Put the clicker and in her chest and bang, she disappeared. Oh, there's a light over there. Well, that's cool. And there should be a, a yeah, stash. But there's a house as well. Let's go to this house. First, I guess. Another one of those cult boxes. Oh shit. What is this? Why I cannot see what that is? Oh boy. Uh, something. But we need a key. And it's probably somewhere around that house. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, 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 I'm not here. I'm not here, dude. That was someone else. Jesus Christ, quickly, quickly. Screwdriver. Somebody's like coming here or where? Oh shit, please don't tell me he will go to the stash. What was that? Was that a puzzle? Oh shit, <laughs> nice. That's a puzzle. 
Must be oh, locked the from the other oh, okay. side. Damn it, from this side we cannot enter. Let's go back then. Whoa. What is this? Oh yeah, stash key. You kidding me? Wait, can I go there now quickly? Or it will be impossible. Ah, shit. This will be impossible, I guess. To go through here. Okay, let's go first over here. Just to see what we can do. Uh, yeah, puzzle. Another one of those rhymes. Yes. A child needs their mother to keep them safe and a home as their hiding place because outside the monsters roam and chase. When they ring your doorbell, don't yell. Don't tell them to go away. Give them threats and pray. They won't rock your house down to the ground. Oh boy. Um, child needs their mother to keep them safe at home. Uh, so let's go. Child at home. And outside the monsters roam and chase. Yeah, give them threats. Uh, give them candies. Come on. Monster, where are you? Mm. Mm -hmm. mm, what? Whoa. Was that a ring? Was that a bell ringing? Oh my god. Oh my god. Somebody just came. And he's going upstairs. And we should follow him. Where did he go? To the bathroom. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Oh shit. But he's not here. And no charm. Oh, then he went to the bed. Oh my god. Oh shit, and I need to have a space in my inventory. Oh, come on. Alright, let's heal. Yeah, okay. Let's, um... No, no, no. Oh shit, what are you doing? Jesus Christ. Let's discard of that. And let's pick the charm. And I never have oh, yeah. too many charms. And I will use that charm. I mean, maybe it's better to use it in uh, some boss fight or something. And wait, we are having nothing more in this house? No way. That just quit. Wait. Oh, there's a deer. What are you what are you doing with this flashlight? So soft and sad. No, they are not set. What the She's crazy. I don't know what she's doing, but What the hell? Is she okay? I don't think so. Some documents, a clue, nice. Another side, okay. And, oh, come on. Computer. Manning your stations, alright. Vega. And Dr. Campbell, manning your stations. Okay, second time's the same. But from someone else, okay. That's, uh, that's crazy. Uh, that's nice. That's just fantastic. And, um... Let's see. We can jump down from here? Oh my god, we cannot. Come on. Why? I need to go there and we are having those crazy guys here. Yeah. Whoa, and that's a big guy. Oh shit, with a freaking hammer. So, maybe there's only one guy? No. There's someone else over there. Oh my god. Coming out from bushes. Oh boy. Let's get out of here, Thor. <laughs> With this hammer of yours. He 
he's not coming here, right? No, he's not. But, Jesus, how can I? Let's try it. Come on, quickly. No, 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 no. What? You didn't sell me, dude. What are you talking about? You didn't sell me there. We are having the key, come on. Oh yes. Hunter rifle. Ammunition. Yeah, that's enough. Wait, there was something uh, written there, but... I guess that doesn't matter. And we are having the light here. And what else we are having here? Nothing more. Jesus, what's wrong with this tree here? That is just crazy. Where are we right now? Okay, we are right here and we should go now to... Um, I guess to this Billy's boat. Maybe, or yeah, at least somewhere over here. A stash. We already took it. Oh, we are here now. Oh boy, that's so cool. All right. So, uh, oh, now we can go there. What a beat. Oh, a puzzle. Nice. Okay. What the hell? You cannot go through here or what? Of course you can. There's a rhyme over here. Yes, there is. Another puzzle. No more dolls. Why? Where's another doll? Because we need another one. Um no right, let's see this. Rhyme. To the beach of child when what? To the beach, a child went wandering. Pretty shiny rock she is gathering. But from the water, a monster rose. A horrible beast with a pointy nose, a flapping wing, and dragging tasks. But the child was wrong. It was her mother all along. On a boat, grabbing a towel that's already gone. Oh shit. Wait, what the hell? I mean, are you serious? So, a monster, a child. And a mother as well, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. So, monster came from water. Okay, let's see. Monster. Then the child went wandering. Pretty shiny rocks. Pretty shiny rocks. Oh, maybe this. Jewels. I mean, yeah. Um, yeah, what else? We have no rocks, no beach, nothing like that. <laughs> uh, and a mother on a boat. Yes. And mother on a boat. Yeah, yeah. All right. <gasps> what is going on? What? Whoa. Where? What the hell? There is somebody here? Oh, s oh my god, who is out there? Oh my god, no, not this... Two of those? Jesus Christ. This is just insane. 
Yeah, where do you think it go? Under the sand. Oh, look at that. It's right here. Wait, let's... Oh, shit. I do not have this. Oh, this water is coming there. I should took this flare, right? But I will uh, kill this second one with the flare. Come on, get out of here. What the hell? And where is this one? Bloody hell. This one disappeared as well. What the hell is going on? Where are they? Oh shit, right here. Bloody hell! Oh, die already! Come on! Jesus, that was crazy! And what with the other one? We killed her? No, same freaking music here. Or what? I don't know. I hope second one is dead as well, but... I really don't know what to think about this. This is just insane. Just like that. Uh, no, not the quick slot. Come on, discard that as well. But no healing items. This is just... I don't know if that's a good idea what I'm doing here. Oh. Launch box. Where is it? Where is that launch box? What the hell? Not over here, right? Oh, bloody hell, here. Here you are, okay. Oh man, that was crazy freaking monsters. Now we should go to this place over here. Yep, let's go there. Water is down now, yep. Oh. No more of this strange music. Whoa, that's a launch box. Why is she not saying anything that launch box is closed or something? That is so strange. You are just walking and that's it. Oh, and a page. I guess she is too tired. 
and she have enough already of this. Whoa, return six, scratch. Rose receives a message. Rose woke up from another dream from her idol. Another message. All through her morning routine, she was humming happily. So happily, she realized she was starting to forget what Alan had told her. Something about a hero who would come to save them all. And the hero? Rose frowned. This won't do, Rose Marigold. You know better than to forget. Something about knitwear. The hero liked it? Rose nodded, determined. She'd use the knitwork to guide the hero to the secret stashes she had hid in the forest to help them. Knitwear to mark the spot. Alan will love that, she thought. Now she only needed the knitwork. Rose thought hard. Mandy May was always knitting. Mandy May would help her. All right, Mandy May. She will help us with this. Yes, she is good with that, right? She's doing those sweaters and other things. So, all right. Boat yard. <laughs> nice. Wow, so many two. Oh, okay. I didn't saw that <laughs> at first. It was hidden with the sand. Nice. What else do we have here? Some box with a flare. Okay. Five five five. Oh yeah, those five fives. I saw that before. Yeah. Somewhere from uh, yeah from there. Where those trees are. Bolt cutters. Of course. Beautiful. Just beautiful. And where we will, will be? Oh. Oh. We are already. Oh, this is perfect. We are in rifles. Let's check this molo first. Wait, that's a puzzle. Another rhyme. Another puzzle. Beautiful. And something else here Look or at not? That. Another charm. What? Where? What are you talking about? What is she talking about? What charm? I didn't do the puzzle yet. Is she seeing a charm here? Wow, she's crazy. She's acting really strange now. <laughs> I don't know what she's doing, but damn. Okay, let's see this puzzle. Five little monsters out on the sea competing to see who the winner will be. They rocked their boats to find out who floats until one little monster did fall. Mama called out to the sea and cried at the sea. She replied, on the bottom they will rot if they will not stop rocking their boats. <laughs> okay, that's fantastic. Um, so, monsters on the boat... And mother. Hmm. Mother. Oh, oh shit. Uh, okay. Let's see. Monsters on the boat and mother on the water. Sure. Yes. Oh shit. And what do we have? But oh, wait. Yeah. Right. Freaking hell, I have no space for this. Oh my god, and where is the safe place? Somewhere close, yeah. Because we are in Brightfall. So this is somewhere close. Oh shit, and we have monsters here, alright. Come on, kill me. You can kill me, come on. One more, come on. Whoa, shit, what was that? What did they throw at me? 
Yeah, run away, freakers. Run away. Let's go quickly for this charm. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. Whatever, whatever, guys. Yeah, yeah. Jesus, they are so crazy stupid. All right. And oh, how colors changed. Beautiful. Uh, let's see. So now we can go also to this place. Yes, exactly. Oh, there's a cold stash. And there's a cold stash over here. Nice. We will pick those two. And that's everything that we have to do in uh, Bright Falls. So let's go. Now we have bolt cutters. So we can easily collect those items here. Yep. Then we will just look around in this town later. Right? For now I just want to collect that. And finish this episode. So... Let's use some bolt cutters. That will allow us to enter here. And well... Shit, where should we go then? Another cult stash? Oh, it's right here. Okay. What the hell is this? One, two, three. Wait, what? One, two, three? Oh. Okay, we need to look at something uh, somewhere outside, I guess, right? To find a number somewhere. One, two, three. Oh. Six. Okay. Then what? Okay, here, nine. Alright, six, nine, and... Where else? Not here, maybe from here. Well, at least the fishes are biting again. I didn't like all that hubbub or oh. things. Six, nine, and seven. All right. Oh boy, I hope this is the the order. Yeah, six, nine, seven. Nice, nice, very nice. Okay, six, nine, and seven. Yes, perfect. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is so freaking good. If you steal from the cult, then the cult will come for you. Oh, yes, yes, I know. And I am so afraid that, yeah, I don't know what to do. <laughs> God damn it. What's wrong with those guys? And those threats. Uh, wait, we can go through here, right? Hello? Oh, it's right here. Perfect. Alright, work lock. Over... Overprivileged town hall folks complaining about poor TV reception. Hopefully not due to the paint job. Paint job, okay. Took a photo with the giant moose statue in the park. Great memento. Damn dog keep digging up the flowers. Everything is in park? Park's trash can needed fresh coat of paint. Painted an extra layer. Whoa, okay. Tried painting the large tree in the park, but the weather was too hot. Replaced a screw on the purple park bench. Okay, so everything is in the park. Well, that should be easy. And we are looking for... For symbols. Okay, yep. That's why paint. Okay. Well, let's see. The park. 
Yeah, of course, we know where the park is, right? We picked uh, one of those lunch boxes there. Oh, I can see something over there already. No way. Or oh, this is the lantern. Oh, that was the lantern. Okay. Uh, so we have flowers. Oh, there is this. Okay, nice. So we have that symbol sure again. Coming, oh, yes. Antenna here. Those ones. And, oh. And here. Nice. And that one. All right. Well, I guess now we need to just pick the right order. And that's it. But the order will be, I guess... Uh, yeah. What is written on the list. Like, first. So it should be, yeah, this one, I guess. Uh... This TV, yeah. The TV dish, that should be first. Right, TV dish, then flowers, yeah. And then the last one, okay, nice. So, it will go like that. Uh, what was the one on the dish? It was this one. This one was there, here were those two... Close to each other. I mean, all of them are close to each other. But those two and one on another like that. Yes. Perfect. Beautiful. And now we can pick it up. Oh my god. I guess I will just go back for everything else. <laughs> that I just left in those uh, stashes. Because there were a lot, right? Yes. Right here, right there. Now I will not go back there. I'm not crazy. Come on. Okay. Perfect. So everything in Bright Falls is collected. Now we will go to Watery and to Cauldron Lake as well. But we will go there in another episode. For now I am finishing this one right here. So guys, thank you so much for staying with me. I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. If you did, leave some like or comment. I would appreciate it very much. And if you want to be up to date with the content launch every day, then please hit subscribe button. I will be very grateful. And I will see you very soon in another episode from Alan Wake 2.